back to the ocean this morning. Today is Friday. So we got three full days left. We have Friday, Saturday, and Sunday before we head out. So we're gonna make the most of it. I'm pretty burned, so I got my long sleeves on. We're getting out here after breakfast, getting in our chairs, right by the water. Look at this big machine eating the seaweed. That is crazy. Is he eating it or is he scooping it? He might be scooping it. It's gonna be another fun day. We're doing karaoke tonight. I'm not gonna sing. I think KK is gonna sing. So it's gonna be, it's gonna be a fun day. vacation you can see it see it way back there look at all the sand blown into the pool it's nuts it got real windy so we're gonna head in for cover yeah. we've relocated back to the room the storm never really officially came but that's okay we came up here for a few minutes we're gonna read for a little bit more on our balcony with these great views and see what the afternoon holds for us the main sign. Usually there's a bunch of people up here taking their pictures with it. Look like at a cool little kid water park. A couple of slides for the little small kids. Pretty cool. Yeah, made it got to the mall. Hot. Yeah, Kayla got hot. We, we accidentally walked the past the mall and all the way to the opposite end of the entire resort property. But now we found it our way back to the mall. Just wandering around exploring. They got other restaurants right here. They got an Italian restaurant and a Japanese restaurant. They look pretty cool. Yeah, they're real big in there. Yeah, they're real big. They're probably because more people have to come to these restaurants yeah. than yeah. the restaurants at our resort. Like my shirt. Where? It's shorter though. Oh yeah. Wow. Huh. Did you want to look at any of this, these boutiques or anything? Uh, lots of tchotchkes. Oh, yeah, there's some magnets. Huh. A little gordita. Is that what she's called? I don't know. That's what I call it. This little market has a nice little courtyard. Mm -hmm. Lots of other little vendors with cheap goods to sell you. I think you bought a full sombrero. All right, go. you gotta wear it. You gonna do that? Viva Mexico, tiny little sombreros. <laughs> you I mean, can imagine. Back to the airport. I know this could fit the, on my head at the airport, but imagine having to wear these giant things at the airport. No, I think like people do it. I mean, they got good little, they got all kinds of stuff. People buy them, I bet, because they get here and they're like, oh, I can oh, put yeah. a whole beer in there. Came back to Strikers for a little light lunch as we've been shopping for the past little while. Mm -hmm. Got, a, got some tuna salad, all kinds of different little salads, really. This water tastes fine. Uh, I don't that know. one water was weird. <laughs> just don't, don't, eat, don't drink that one. Yeah. And it's much more empty in here than it was last night. Yeah, last night. Did you get it on film last night? Yeah, I think I filmed some of yeah, the craziness. Uh -huh. Crazy. We were sitting about here in the middle of all the madness. This place was absolutely packed. It was crazy, but it was prime people watching, which we love to do. Yep. New bag. Yeah, Kayla got her a new bag. Yeah, beach bag slash we got lots of stuff to cool to bring back. Oh, yeah. yeah, have to carry it on the airplane. <laughs> Whoa, these dudes are nuts. This isn't a bad reading spot. Do a little reading on the balcony this afternoon while Kayla's getting ready for dinner. And you know, it could be worse. It's actually pretty awesome out here. Enjoying a nice glass of champagne or sparkling wine or something they left in our room the other day. As we finalize getting ready for the evening, Kayla's getting her hair done, drinking a little bit of this stuff, read my book periodically, and watching them scoop up seaweed. The seaweed's crazy today because I think there's storms in the area. So like the ocean's like super high waves, tons of seaweed is washed up. They got a dump truck and like a big um, construction scooper thing, whatever you call that. 
up here cleaning it all up. It's pretty wild. Coming down to the beach after we're all dressed up, trying to get a couple of pictures snapped off. It feels great out here, doesn't it? Yeah, it feels awesome. The wind feels really good. Oh yeah, look at this crazy seaweed. This is a lot of seaweed. That's what they've been trying to scoop up and take out via the dump truck. A lot of seaweed. Walking to dinner. We're eating at the regular Mexican restaurant tonight, not the taco bar. We've already eaten at the taco bar. So now we're gonna have just the regular Mexican food. Got the A. I think you can get tacos too though. Yeah, you can get tacos, but yeah. it's just not like the hibachi taco yeah. bar thing, so it better be good. Yeah. Ceviche and tacos. I got the blackened, what kind of fish was it? I think it was Some sort of blackened, fish. no, some sort <laughs> of blackened, no. Some sort of blackened fish with a bunch of good sauce and some rice. I didn't know the rice was gonna be there. And you got the- uh, Beef steak with black beans. Yeah, the beans and everything look good underneath there. I think, I think that's a plantain. That is a big old plantain on there. That's gonna be good. Yeah. <laughs> I got, pretty good. I got the tres leches, which looks like the cake we've had like everywhere that is just not very good. This little nugget right here is supposed to be a carrot. I mean a cricket. I said a carrot. A carrot? A cricket. Mine looks like it's got cheese on top. It does look like cheese. You get the bread pudding, which might be really good because it's just like, like real cinnamony? soaked. Like cinnamony? Yeah. And like the core soaked bread. Oh, maybe. Take a bite and see. That's how everything is. All right, I'm gonna eat this cricket. Should I get a little bit of the meringue with it? No, eat the cricket by itself so you can really taste it. There's a meringue back on there. It's such a small little hunk of chocolate. I'm not even gonna know I'm eating a cricket. Okay, it's on, it's right there. Supposedly this is a cricket. I'm gonna eat it. What's it like? Crunchy? It just tastes like chocolate and then you can kind of feel like some pieces in there. So it's chocolate. Oh, you feel pieces? Yeah, like body parts and legs. Stop. It's brilliant. You couldn't even tell really that it was a cricket. If you would have never said it was a cricket, no one would have ever known. So, mm. not bad. I was expecting a whole cricket, like see its head and antennas. Yeah. Oh well. Okay, well, at least you can say you did it. I tried. <laughs> We are now headed to karaoke night at one of the big theaters. Kayla wants to sing karaoke. I don't know if I will. You, would you say you're nervous? I don't know. I might not. We'll see. It depends. I'm sure it's going to be packed. Every time we've been to the theaters, it's been packed. Yeah. But we haven't seen karaoke yet karaoke at the theater. just fun to watch, too. Yeah. Oh, there is some, some event on the beach way over by the pier. What? Something going on? Yeah, something's going on oh, up there. Oh, yeah, some kind of party. Always some sort of party going on around here. The Macaulay Culkin Theater. <laughs> I love the entryway to these theaters with all these trees, the palm trees. Yeah. It's really nice. All right, we're pretty much the first ones in the theater. We got front row, front stage. I don't want to be the first one to sing. No, you don't want to be the first one to sing. You want to be maybe like third. Third, yeah. Well, but we're here. Here's Kayla's ador adorning fans behind us. <laughs>
back in the mall after Kayla rocked and won. She won the voice Barcelo. <laughs> Everybody, all the judges hit their button and turned around for Kayla. So she I won. I did have fans though. You did have fans. <laughs> and now we're back in the mall. I was like, no more paparazzi. No, oh, no, no mas. <laughs> no mas. <laughs> I like all the trees lit up. Yeah. We need a I fake one like that in our yard. Yeah. I want one of those in our backyard. Why is the carousel not going? Yeah. I haven't seen it going once. It must be broken. Oh, Can we bring our own drinks into the casino? Red trees, red trees. We need one of these pre-lit red trees like this in like our backyard or even front yard. With lights on it? Yeah. So, I mean the fake tree that lights up like this. Yeah. But you could change the colors for all the year-round activities. Oh yeah. So like Christmas, Red Halloween. Green for Christmas, March for Halloween. Right. That'd be pretty cool. Maybe the strikers. 